G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video review. Today we're going to be having a look at another figurine that's new in my collection and that's the Hellboy Mezzets. Um, as you can tell from my videos, I'm a bit of a Mighty Mug collector and uh, I would love to have seen a, a Hellboy Mighty Mug but unfortunately being a, a line that's not covered by Hasbro, um, the Hellboy comic series, um, we were never going to see that. So Mezzets, the lovely people at Mezzets, uh, came up with the next best thing. And so when I saw him, I uh, had to get him for the collection. So we'll start off with his box, as you can see there. Sort of the, uh, the comic style, uh, rather than the movie version. And uh, as they call the, uh, the methods, they're called designer vinyl action figures. So we have a quite detailed design there. And then we move down the side of the box, so you know it's Hellboy. And uh, as you can see here, it says it's the 2009 Con Mezco exclusive. So obviously this one was brought out specifically for a, uh, a comic convention. Haven't heard of the Mezco one, but uh, if you have, uh, feel free to comment and let me know how it goes. So anyway, let's move to the figure. As you can see here, straight away, probably the first thing that catches your eye is the uh, the nice yellow eyeballs, or the eyes. They'll really draw you into the figure. And then a bit of a grimacing look with the teeth gnarled. Then we have where his uh, horns would be, protruding from his uh, forehead. And then moving down the body, you can see we have the large fist, the Hellboy fist, that we've all known to love. We then uh, move around, we also come with an accessory, which is his, uh, his, his gun. And then spinning around, you can tell from the, we have his tail. Now the tail you can uh, move and put into different positions. So there's a little bit of articulation there. You also have some articulation in the shoulders, you can like, raise the arms up and down. And you can also actually uh, position the head and swivel the head as well. So you, there is a little bit of articulation, a bit of give in the figurine, which allows you to put him into a few different poses, if you so desire. Anyway, um, I know it's not going to be a long review, but uh, he's a great little figure. And uh, for the price I picked him up, he was uh, pretty impressive too. So if you're looking for a Hellboy figurine or a figure to add to your collection that's a little bit out of uh, the normal stock standard uh, figurine designs, I, I really recommend having a look at these uh, these Hellboy methods. So thanks for watching, keep subscribing, also uh, keep an eye out for a review on these two guys, a Superman and Batman figurine from the Superman Batman range. Um, that'll be up shortly. So thanks for watching, cheers!